Now that... Uh, what the hell is that? That's a SPO pad, protecting the universe from imperfect life forms since 1967. It's like a mall cop with a 5,000 meter volt taser without a moral code. Be careful, Tex. I could get hurt. Well, that was sooner than I expected. Next time, try destroying the SFO pad before entering Mel Dondo's office. Well, it's a security drone. If I enter its line of sight, I'm toast. Wow, nothing is so simple or wonderfully effective as blunt force trauma. It's locked. I won't be able to enter. It's locked. This is a door. Wow, a place even sleazier than yours. And you have an animal print bedspread. Motel postcards? Maldonado must make his living spying on cheating spouses. <laughs> Yuck. There's gum in this shoe. Both Maldonado and I appreciate subtle storytelling techniques. Maybe we could have been friends, if you were alive. What's this? It's a key to the exclusive Llama Club. <laughs> it's the depressed man's kitchen. Emily? Oh, man. I hope she's doing this to get through school. Both Maldonado and I appreciate subtle storytelling techniques. Maybe we could have been friends, if you were a lot. It's the only Roach Hotel where you have a better chance of survival inside than outside. Hmm. I prefer Weenie World's tater tots. Well, even I wouldn't stoop so low as to reading someone's diary. His filing techniques are crude at best. speak to Carlos. Tex? Sorry, have we met? <laughs> that woman knew me, but hung up quickly when she realized I didn't know her. If we can find her, maybe we could get some answers. She must have visited Chandler while she was doing business with Maldonado. Maybe someone around here will recognize the photo. Larry Hammond wasn't really a mutant. I wanted to make sure you came here alone. Well, I hope you were more careful about being followed than I was. Now, I have a very strong sense of self-preservation. I even brush my teeth carefully. Yeah, it shows. If this woman has been doing business with Maldonado, maybe someone else on Chandler Avenue will recognize her. Hmm. I prefer Weenie World's tater tots. Amateur. Air cream. Glad I don't need this. Hey, 
Hey, Mr. Murphy. Still running the decryption program. You can hang with me till it's done. Shouldn't be more than four or five hours. Who's that? I hope you don't mind, Mife. I've been telling folks in the neighborhood about your situation, just so they know it's the old text they're dealing with. Let me know what else I can do for you. I might have seen this lady in here not long ago. Didn't catch a name. Not again. You're gonna get me fired. Or worse. That's a fine piece of humanity there. She stopped by the other day and checked out our selection. Took her about two seconds to realize it was all crap. So she seemed to know her stuff. As I made it perfectly clear, your status as a pain customer earns you a modicum of goodwill. I suggest you use it judiciously. Sorry, you lost me at modicum. Look, answer a few questions for me and I won't kick your butt when I get my memory back. Lovely. Oh, she may have come by here. I can't be sure. You know, it used to really piss me off, the way you'd always come around asking your questions, but... Now that you're paying, I know for a fact I've never seen this fox before, because if I had, she'd be my lady love. Hey Tex, how's your case progressing? Yeah, I've seen this woman in here. In fact, she picked up a piece of mail that's been delivered here. I might be able to get a name or address for you. Let me see if I have an image of the envelope. Yep, got it. I'll print it out for you. Holly sends the information about the mystery woman to my smart Alex and I get a new location on the map. It's on the coast near Monterey. Whoever owns this place has mucho dinero. Larry Lama? I loved that guy when I was a kid. It's closed. Most businesses on Chandler Avenue won't open until later. It's like a swipe card reader. It's a key to the exclusive Lama Club. Only the most prestigious people are invited to this club. Mmm, cigarettes. Yummy. The air outside feels thick, like I'm breathing through a pair of dirty gym socks. It's a high radiation day. Most everyone will be staying inside, but I need to hunt for some work. I always like to start the day with a traditional P.I. breakfast. <coughs> It's the spot. Wow, this would match my bedspread perfectly. I wonder where they got it. Yeah, I bet some intense smoking competitions take place here. <laughs> 